Hey, what's up guys? Frozen here, and welcome back to another episode of this map knowledge series. Today, I'm going to be covering Coastline. As per usual, this series is supposed to be comprehensive, so even though there's going to be basic things in this video, there's definitely going to be things that even most veteran players haven't seen before. So, with that out of the way, let's get started. Instead of placing an air jab on the outer door, place one on the inner door so that way if anyone tries to go to the window or the door, they'll get caught by the air jab. You may be able to get a kill on any defenders in bathroom by peeking this drone hole. As a defender, you can counter this by simply prone peeking the drone hole. You have a huge advantage doing this on defense. You can see four service door through the B2 hatch. This throw is very easy and with practice you can get it to land anywhere you want. Op 4 eliminated. Mission successful. To get a deeper angle into courtyard and back lobby, you can simply vault onto the flower pot and sprint onto this railing. If you punch the bottom of this window, you can prone peek anyone repelling on billiards window and you'll be safe from anyone standing on the ground. As an attacker, the easiest way to counter this is to stand on these boxes. By breaking only the top layer of the floor, you can throw a C4 into it and you can kill anyone planning default. You can watch the kitchen rotate from blue bar. You can do the same thing from billiards. By breaking the floor below, you can shoot a zero cam under pool table. You can do pretty much the same thing with Valkyrie. As of Shadow Legacy, you can't shoot through the Aqua Bar anymore. By opening this part of the floor, you can nade vase from Blue Bar. By opening this blue wall and the couch wall, you can get a deep angle in the kitchen. You can counter the default hookah window spawn peak by simply breaking this glass and peeking wide. By shooting the barricade at an angle, you can bullet hole spawn peak towards ruins without breaking the glass. You can see for anyone sitting on the left side of the aqua balk from red. Make sure you open up the window and prep raise though so they don't know that you're about to throw it. Your location has been compromised. You can see for the outside office door from luggage. If you remain in this zone, you will be detected by hostiles. You have been spotted by hostiles. Fall back. You can hide in this cubby on short. You can destroy mirror windows in theater from outside front door. By repelling on DJ Valk, you can get some unexpected angles into various rooms. These objects aren't bulletproof, but they do help you stay hidden. You can watch office through the drone hole in pink. By punching big window during prep phase, you'll often find a drone just sitting outside. Five seconds. By placing a claymore here, you're more likely to catch anyone running out office, rather than placing one on the office door itself. You can flame behind the aqua bar from the roof vent. Make sure you shoot it low enough, because sometimes the flame will expand onto the roof instead of down through the drone hole. You can do the same thing on cool vibes too. You can hide proximity alarms in this flower pot. You can spawn peek ruins from hookah door. Zone, you will be by, by making a hole here, you can watch the mudroom door into sunrise from the hookah hatch. By vaulting onto objects, you can jam various places from below.
can destroy the jungle default from mud. You can cade the left side of the VIP wall from base. This denies the deep angle into pink. You can watch service store through this shelf. Op four eliminated. Mission successful. As long as you're ready to move the drone, if you shoot a pest into this drone hole, you'll easily catch a drone most rounds. Just make sure you drive it away before it loses signal. By shotgunning up in the bottom of the kitchen wall, you can watch the jungle door from lobby. By shotgunning the top of the kitchen wall, you can watch the kitchen window jump in from luggage. By doing this, you can also place an evil eye in kitchen hall that can look into sight. You can hide magnets in many places around mudroom. You have been spotted by hostiles. Fall back. By jumping out mud window, you may surprise anyone who's checking for the hookah window peak. You can open above anyone playing behind the sunrise bar by upside down repelling on this window. You can see anyone entering service door from penthouse. In this area. It's possible to kill people behind the aqua bar by looking through the vent on the roof. You can wallbang anyone sitting behind pink bar. You can vault onto pink bar and get an angle into aqua through the bomb. With the new bomb rework, this is even stronger than it was before. However, keep in mind that for some reason you can't vault onto the bar when the props on top of it are destroyed. You can kill anyone playing behind hookah bar through this pixel from the balcony. You can place an evil eye that looks underneath the pool table. You can run out hookah door and kill anyone on DJ Bell. By proning in this corner, you can look through the server rack. You can hide behind this shelf in service. You may catch somebody rotating through security by spamming this window. Op 4 eliminated. Friendly mission successful. Instead of holding the billiards cut from this angle, you can hold it from penthouse and even B2 instead. You can sludge below the aqua bar. You can also do this in a few other spots. You can smoke glitch the billiards default plant from pink. This also gets anyone nearby the aqua bar. You can smoke glitch sunrise default from couches. Uh, four eliminated. You can hide drones in sunrise by jumping them above the bar. By opening a hole in this wall, you can watch the VIP window from theater. You can open this angle as an attacker as well to watch 90. You can get a deep angle into sunrise by hiding behind this tree. By vaulting onto this umbrella outside office, you can kill anyone peeking over the aqua bar. You can throw Valcams under bed and you can see the feet of anyone in penthouse. This cam is pretty much impossible to see and even if you know it's there, it's very difficult to destroy it. You can kill anyone coming out of pool spawn by running out VIP window. Instead of holding bottom white like this, you can simply run onto the railing and look straight down. Everyone's going to be looking at the top of the stairs and thus won't check for you. Thank you for watching all the way to the end of this video, I hope you all enjoyed. If you learned something new, please leave a like and consider subscribing as both of them really help the channel out a lot. If there's anything you'd like to see me cover on this channel, leave it in a comment down below and I may make a video on it. Like I said before, thank you for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.